Blade, you're handling yourself pretty well against Kratos back there. You must have gotten a lot stronger than before. That couldn't have been his full strength. He was holding back on me. Damn it, he was just toying with me. Oh, hi. I guess I guess we're not that oh I guess guess we're not going that way. Out of my way, fool. Okay, so. Yeah, get get that traitor out of my party. Get that traitor out of my freaking party. Playing Tales of uh, the World Radiant Mythology. Okay. It's not too bad, Pika. It's not too bad. Oh, wait. Oh, no, I can do this. Move this. Because I think it's the other one. I think it's that one that it needs to actually go on there. Okay, so we'll do this. Move this down. And we're going to move this one back over. down. That should give us the path to push that off. More lore. Mm -hmm. I wound up having to start my game over uh, as a close range class because Lloyd was just too fast. Yeah. Lloyd's, Lloyd's really fast. Lloyd's fast. Okay, so that should trigger this. Yep. Okay. And that opens that. Kratos has been deceiving us from the very beginning. I had thought there was something strange about him. In the end, I couldn't figure it out in time. I even figured it out, Rain. I hate myself for being so naive. Damn him, he'll pay for this, I swear. Lloyd. I still think he's his dad. But the thing is, if that is the case, then, how does he remember Lloyd? I wonder if that Eudrasio guy is the leader of Crucius. Yes, most likely. The sleeping goddess Martell is the symbolic entity. While well, Eudrasio actually executes their plans. And Kratos is really one of Eudrasio's subordinates. What is he trying to do turning Colette into Martell? More importantly than that, I want to know why Martell requires a body to be her vessel. Ah, right. In other words, that means she doesn't have a body. So wait, if you don't have a body, and if all you have left is your heart, can you still live? Colette is currently living despite having lost her heart. Perhaps the opposite is possible as well. I suppose when you put it that way. If we can find out why Martell has lost her body, we also might be able to find out what, what it is that Eudrasso is trying to do. Well, either way, I want to beat the ever-living crap out of Kratos. Okay, what is the what is it gonna do? Oh, it's the electricity thing again? Okay. Okay, how do I get those chests? That is the question. How do we get those chests? Do I have to have Colette? Well, don't train yourself on you, Jesse. Oh, he definitely is crazy. That is 100% for sure. Um, how do I get access to those two chests? Alucard, is that you? Did you change your name again? Did you change your name again? Oh, I should have used that as that but first. Ah, oh, crap. Ah, oh, I didn't realize. Dang it. Yeah, I need all three blocks. I didn't realize it in time. Son of a... 
I, can I leave the area and come back? And all three will be available to me. Please. No. Nope. Damn it. Alright. Last time for sure. Actually, you're right, Pika. I could do that. Thank you, Pika. Thank you. Thank you, Pika. Pika, this this is why this is why I need you more in my life. You're the smart one. Okay, so. We've, we've already been through all of those, so we're not going to worry about them. Yeah, what what would you like to be... What would you like to go by now? That way we're, we're addressing you, right? Okay, so we're going to move this. Move that down. And this is going to allow us to push this one off. Probably go with everything, anything you want you're not picking. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna call you uh, Smitty Wor Worbin Jaegerman Jensen. That's what I'm gonna call you from now on. Smitty Wor Worbin Jaegerman Jensen. I'm number one. Yeah, you are number one. Okay, so now we're gonna do this. I'm not smart. I'm, I'm not the one doing the puzzles. Hey, listen. You are smart, Pika. Whether you want to admit it or not, you're smart. So just accept it. Bampy? Hey, yo, Bampy! There we go. Straw hat. And another EX gem level 2. I need to start using some of these EX level 2 gems, dude. So what are your level 2s? Uh, let's wait, why is it different? Oh, they're different? Oh, th oh that's level 1. That's level 2. Alright, so yours is Spirit, which gives you more TP. Neutralizer occasionally nullifies received damage. And increases elemental defense. What are your level twos? So dash, TP, and guard plus. Uh, I think Sheena might need a level two. Dodge, vitality, and slows reaction time of enemies and dungeons. What is Lloyd's level two? Vitality, mobility, and dodge. Okay. Well, if I replace this, I could go with the mobility and battle. I think, actually, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to replace taunt with another level two. And I'm going to put a uh, dash to increase my, my movement in battle. Now I'm, I'm just really fast now, which is kind of nice. Um, okay. I think I'm going to keep the rest for now. I don't think I'm going to do anything on Colette because I don't see myself using Colette. I think your puzzles are easier to solve when you aren't the one that actually solving them. I get that. All right, so now I can just pull this. Uh, get to the dentist today to replace the bad feeling. They try to screw me by an extra hundred. So, say the same. yeah, that's that's a little that's a little ridiculous. That's a little ridiculous there. Uh, that's a little ridiculous. Well, it's like you know, in about a week or so, I gotta go back to the dentist to get another tooth uh, extracted. I got the one down the bottom of my gum. Now I have to get the one up top. So. All right, so now that we're good, we actually have that. And then we're just going to go through this again. We've already done it, but we're going to go through it again. I'm, I'm, I'm personally just not a fan of doctors in general, if I'm being honest. I'm just not a huge fan of doctors. 
Not a huge fan of doctors. Yes, so what you're telling me is that Durgan is not actually a dragon. Hey, listen here. Listen here. I am not a shark. My goodness. If we get into TSA, I'm going to save cash and let them rot. I'll get Im implants. I get that. So you're, you're trying to get a job with TSA? I've been lied to. Hey, listen here. You haven't been lied to. You have not been lied to. Okay, obviously, I'm probably going to need that change. When we go into probably this next area. I, br I brush and stuff, but then I just can suck my start. That's fair. That's fair. Energy core changed. I pushed the switch. Alright, so. Let's see. How are we doing this? Energy change confirmed. Firm. Uh, let's change the energy again. Maybe that'll change things. Okay, not what I am hoping to see out of this. How am I doing this? that has to go down there on that the question is how okay how how is this supposed to work because i can't move during it during can I push it up here no I cannot so what am I supposed to do uh, I eventually got composed to do a song by a Ukrainian folk uh, composer whose name okay oh okay interesting So changing the energy levels does nothing for me right now. The question is how do I move this thing? Doing that does nothing for me. I'm I'm missing something. I'm missing something that I have to do. The question is what? What am I missing in this room? New Legend Orca in a Time remake looks interesting. They took out the Water Temple level gimmick for the Water Temple. Oh, but it's not the same without the Water Temple. Legend, you've done it. Me, power are you? It's good to see you. What am I missing in this section? What am I missing? Give me an incredibly weird request. Okay. I need you to press everything in the room that's interactable once. Okay. Well, that's that. Insufficient power, please charge. Okay. Well, let's have to hit you with like a double dose. Okay, and then there's that. 
And that's, that's everything that's interactable in this room. That's everything that's interactable in this room. I, I don't understand what I'm missing here. I can go up to the previous floor, but I don't think there's gonna be anything on the previous floor that I'm I'm missing here. Cause all that's here are these. And there's no and there's no way for me to take the these things down. Wait. Oh my god, Pika, you're a genius. You're a Pika, you're a genius. I didn't even make the freaking connection. It took me going back up to realize what that platform was for. Because now I bring these down and there's my ticket. Okay, so I, I, just, I have to arrange them in the way in order to get across. I just have to arrange them in order to make a platform. No, nope. come back down. Over. Back up. It, it took me a bit to kind of like realize what I had to do with that. But when I saw the when I saw the pink on the floor, I'm like, wait a minute, I can use those. Cause now I bring these back down, and it's a it's a bridge across. And then I can do this, this activates this thing, and that one should probably what? Drop the water level? Yep. Drop the water level. Okay. So now here's the question. Oh, I can get down right there. So I drop that now. I come across here. I use this to come down. This pushes over. Speaking of water levels that you have to change the level on. And then we hit this. And the door opens. Oh, there's a chest right there hiding. Protect ring. What does the protect ring do? Uh, reduces physical damage, but raises elemental. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Here we go. Damn it. What's so special about me? It's that x sphere he has. These renegades need to hurry up and make up their freaking minds about whether they're our enemies or not. Boy, what are we going to do now? We've got to save Colette somehow. She's going to die if she's made into Martell's vessel. But what can we do? Sheena, where did you get your X sphere Huh? Well, that came out of nowhere. I got this before I came here. They attached it to me at the Imperial Research Academy. Is it normal for people to equip X spheres in Teveala? No, not at all. The technology was originally brought over by the Renegades. And nowadays, X spheres are mainly attached to machines. Wait a second. So Teteala and the Renegades are on the same side? I'm not sure if you could say that. Kind of makes the sense, Renegades though. The Renegades were the ones that brought us information about the nature of the two worlds. And the plan to assassinate the Chosen was their idea. They talked the King and the Pope into it. If you desire for Teteala to prosper, kill the Chosen of Silveront. That's horrible! Lloyd, I suggest we go to Teteala. Why Teteala? Don't you remember what Ewan said? Angels are half-elves that evolved using special x spheres called Crucius Crystals. Oh, I get it. Colette's current condition is caused by the Crucius Crystal. Since Tethayala is studying the x spheres they might have the they cure. They know something about Crucius Crystals as well. That's a good idea. I'm pretty sure that they're studying the Crucius Crystal that belongs to Tethayala's Chosen at the Imperial Research Academy. There's a Chosen in Tethayala too? Of course. The world regeneration ritual is carried out in Tefeala as well. The Church of Martell exists too. The 
But if they've been carrying out the regeneration that many times, why hasn't Martel's vessel been completed already? I'm curious about that myself. Perhaps those corpses lined up in the Tower of Salvation were... No, never mind. Yeah, there are too many things that we don't know. Crucius' objective, the renegades, the method to save Colette. So let's just start with what we can do now. And that, hey, no worries. No worries, Vamp. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. So, we're going to Tetheala? Yeah, that's the only lead we have right now. And this time, I'm going to fulfill my role. I'm not going to let Colette bear the burden all by herself anymore. Wait a minute. That's great and all, but how are we going to get to Tepeyala? I'm sure Sheena knows how to get there, correct? Yep. My understanding is that you can travel to Tepeyala by passing through a distortion in space. As far as I know, crafts called Riyads are the only things that can do that. Where are they? The Renegades should have them. They should be somewhere on this base. Okay then, let's get going. So I don't think this is going to be spoilers, um, because I don't think they really bring it up again with Rain is right. Yeah, here's here's my whole thing. It's like, you know, Rain brought, brought up a really good point. If, you know, if they've done this so many times, why hasn't, why hasn't the right body for Martell been made already? You know, it's just, it's a little odd. You know, it's, it's a little, little weird and a little odd that the fact that they have not gotten the, you know, the right body for Martell. You know, because maybe it's like, maybe they figured out, you know, every single chosen group figures out why they have to do what they have to do. And they end up this fighting against the, the church because... Man, that was pathetic. Ooh, sweet. Combat X skill. What did I learn? What's the new X skill? B guard. Avoid staggering if hit during a back step. Not always effective. <laughs> That's fine. Um, I'm actually going to take off the accuracy. And I'm going to put on more defense. Okay, good. So I'm, I'm actually kind of like in the middle of the road with everything now, which is kind of nice, actually. Uh, you have more S-type than T-type. Um, let's put that on. Yeah, all the bodies in the towers. Are, yeah, that's what I kind of figured is that they're failed vessels. That's what I kind of figured. Is that their failed vessels? Uh, let's do. Let's do that. I have to look at Sheena's skills to figure out what skills are going to be the best for her. I'm assuming probably my the Riyads are in here. Yep. It failed because they had they never had the power of friendship. Friendship. Oh, so these are the Riards. Okay, those are sick. I'm not going to lie. Up to us. All right, then. Tetheola, here we come. Who's got a way to go before I can find out? I figured as much. That's cool. That's cool. My fa my favorite trash raccoon of a character. Ah, that's fair. Whoa! What's happening? I don't know. It just suddenly... Look, the fuel gauge is empty. So that's it. Since you've broken the seals in Silverant, there's not enough mana in this world. And that means... We're gonna fall!
Reminds me of Neo Kui. Meep, I actually think you would enjoy playing this, honestly. I think you would enjoy playing it. Well. Those seem better days. I think we managed to avoid destroying them completely. But they're useless unless we get some fuel. What's the fuel? Coal? Hey, nobody died. Coal? Jeez. Oh, how do you guys manage to actually live in Silverant? Then magic, I assume. Perhaps the lightning that Volt produces? Then all we have to do is have Sheena summon Volt, right? I haven't made a pact with Volt. Well, then I guess we'll just have to leave these here. Oh, and here I thought Magi technology was infallible. Hey, what's that? That's the Tower of Salvation. Why is that here? This is Tepe. Of course. The Tower of Salvation appears in the Flourishing World. The Tower also appeared on your side after Colette received the Oracle, right? Two worlds. Two towers. What about the Holy Ground? The Church of Martel is also over here, correct? Is the Holy Ground called Carlon? Yes. The place where the Tower of Salvation lies is the Holy Ground of Carlon. The same is in your world. Where the peace treaty was signed to end the ancient war. There can't be two of them. Are you sure yours isn't a fake? We have records in our museums that depict how the hero Mythos called the two ancient kings to the holy ground of Carlon in order to forge a peace treaty. And such records exist on our side as well. Instruments used to sign the treaty can be found in the Palma Costa Academy. So either one side is fake. Or maybe they're actually both real. Or the tower literally is what connects the two worlds together. Lloyd, that's not possible. Don't get mad. I was just kind of saying stuff. Anyway, let's get going. It's true we aren't going to get anywhere by pondering about it here. Wow, it's our first adventure in Tetheola. Genus, this isn't a field trip. Says you, Rain. I gotta say, that was quite a surprise. Indeed, you don't get the opportunity to fly through the sky very often. Or fall from the sky, either. It can't be helped. When you break the seals in Silverant, the mana over here grows thin. Even so, it's still a lot thicker over here than in Silverant. Oh, you could tell that? Of course, because Genus and the prof Professor are elves. Why can elves tell that? Well, because they're elves. Yes, you are literally an entirely different world. Lloyd's theory of being both being real is somehow impossible. Yeah, Genus. Genus just doesn't want to believe it. Hello. Yep. Ah, fine. Yeah, I mean, hurt. it's not wrong. Oh! Battle theme change. That was just warming up. Ooh, new compound EX skill. Okay, when what's the new one? Able to turn around instantly even when dashing. Ooh, fancy. Fancy, fancy, fancy. I am a hypocrite. Hey, Colette. Colette, can you hear me? It looks like she can't even tell you're talking to her right now. Anyway, at the moment, facing the decision between Colette and the world for a split second, I, choose the, I chose the world. Even though it's nothing but a false piece. It was unavoidable when a single decision you make could destroy the entire entire world. Casually choosing between your friend's life instead would have been a still at the moment I abandoned Colette. I'm a hypocrite. Damn it. Excuse me, Mr. Bird. Uh, I'm trying to get this, uh, this, this thing right here. 
Everyone needs a little bit of exercise every now and again, you know? Another EX gem level 2. I'm getting a bunch of these now. Eh. Eh. Haha. <laughs> mm, you ever play, um... What, have I ever played what, me? Do -do 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 -do. Man, that was the first time I've ever flown between worlds. Although we want... We wound up falling. There was insufficient energy, so that couldn't be helped. Yeah, I really want to fly again, but I guess now really isn't the time for that. Yes, we need we need to hurry. Uh, Lloyd isn't wrong. Presumably, all elves and half elves are able to sense uh, the ambient mana, uh, likely due to some sort of ingrained sensitivity to stuff like that. So, in essence, Gene and Raiders can sense a lot. Yeah, they technically can. I mean, it's just like in the D, just like in the D and D sense, um, elves can detect magic a lot easier because they're around it a little bit more. I have not played Xenosaga. I have not. Do I want to play Xenosaga? Yes. What's wrong, Lloyd? Uh, nothing. It's just I hurt. Pe I hurt the people of Visalia. And this time, I couldn't protect Colette either. Although I had gotten a little stronger, but now I think I haven't progressed at all. Lloyd, you've always tried to do the best you could. You didn't give up, and now we've made it all the way to Tethiala. You're not like the other humans. So that's why I like you, Lloyd. Thanks, Genus. Okay, then. We've come all the way here and all. We're not going to give up now. We're going to find a way to save Colette and the world. Yeah, let's do it. Lloyd just doesn't have the big words to give a full-blown explanation. Lloyd has a rough go. Yeah, he, Lloyd has had a majorly rough go of it right now. Aha. Mine. Cool orbit. I'm assuming that's probably something for you, right? Oh my god, that is definitely for you. Jesus Christ. That's really good for you, Genus. And I literally ran all the way around to avoid him, and I still managed to hit him. things anyway. Fair boy. Hey, stop being a rude little wolf. Growing up hurts. It absolutely does. Growing up does, in fact, hurt. Do you have any new skills coming? Nope. Uh, do you have any new skills? Nope. Do you have any new skills? Nope. Do you have any new skills? No. Well, no one has new skills. Card of Fire. I'm gonna assume that that's way better for you. Yep. Thank you very much. Uh, I remember reading a fanfic about this game where you dress up kidnaps Lloyd's way at the beginning before Lloyd is able to get himself in trouble and exile from the village. That's an interesting fanfic. That's an interesting... The angel who appeared in the Tower of Salvation, he was unbelievably powerful. Yeah, I sense the power unlike anything we've faced so far. Even, uh, I even thought we were going to die at that time. Drasil, that's what Kratos called him. Drasil, huh? Hey, by the way, where are we going? What the? You're the one that said, let's go. I thought you knew where you were going. How do I know? I'm from Silveron. Yes, of course, I know. Mel Mel Tokyo, the Imperial City, the center of Tefeala. It's the city where the King of Tefeala resides. Is it far from here? It's not that far, just north. Mel Tokyo, huh? All right, let's go ahead and get and go ahead and move. All right. So basically, he winds up getting brainwashed, essentially, and joining Curse's now. That's... Interesting, actually. Oh, I love how Noish just comes with us. Noish, what are you upset about? 
I would assume he's upset about the crash. Oh, I'm sorry, Noish. Hey, I'm trying to apologize. Fine, whatever. No supper for you tonight, you hear me? 